What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of The Last of Us Part 2 here on The School Zone. So I had a ton of fun in the last episode, just exploring around. I know there wasn't a lot of action. Hopefully this episode makes up for that, but uh, it was a lot of fun. If you had some fun, too, and you're looking forward to this episode, make sure you hit that subscribe button and throw a like on the video. And let's get going. All right, I think we're supposed to be heading this way. Looks like there's a bunch of little shops we can explore. So, let's head on in. Ooh, dark. All right, some nice multivitamins there. This should just go around to that fence I saw, yep. Okay. Some more propaganda from the WLF. All right, let me see where this goes, and we'll circle around. Yep, I bet we... Uh, oh, there's another rust and coffee over there. All right, I bet we got to climb over that truck. So let's check this side out first. Okay, that's as far as that goes. Ooh, looks like it goes down. All right, hang on. <laughs> oh, it's locked. Okay, let's check it out. Looks sort of ominous. <laughs> Whoa. Well, I see a workbench. All right. Clicker killer. <laughs> That's cool. All right, we're full on tape. Let's see if we can make anything with that. Uh, well, we can definitely make one of those. Okay. All right, we are doing really good. So, 
me check this out and then we'll uh, see if we can craft anything. Okay, so I have stability and capacity on that. That's good. That's what I wanted. Damage on that. Uh, stability. That's what I was looking to upgrade on this. Nice. All right. Now we got the full-on sniper rifle. Okay, awesome. I'm very happy with that. Here, let me swap this out for uh, the revolver. Okay, I guess it wasn't so ominous after all. <laughs> yep, okay, awesome. Alright, well, let's keep going. Yes, that's it. Okay, I think that's it in this little area. We're about to leave the area, so I hope I didn't miss anything, but uh, yeah, let's go. That's a little foreshadowing there. Hold on, tell me. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if I can climb that. I can. Wow. Nice, I'll take it. Okay, cool. Just a little bonus area, I think, that uh, most people probably wouldn't even check because um, they didn't think they could get up here. Let's see what this note's all about. Looks like they move from one dictatorship to another.
Hmm. It's like an old timey telescope. An old timey grandfather clock. Just want to check something real quick. Okay, so we have a rust and coffee, and we can't really get. Well, let me see something real quick. Nope. One, let me climb that wall. Okay, well, let me swing around back here and see what's uh, what's going on. Oh, I see a ladder over there. All right, I think we've been in here, but I'm just going to check real quick. Yep. All right, let me check this rust and coffee real quick and then we'll uh and then we'll head on. I saw a little prompt or something. Didn't you see that? Let me, let me do that again. Oh, it's for the door. Okay. Ooh, it's locked. I knew it. <laughs> All right, let's do some duck crawling here. Ugh, gross. Look at all those little bugs. <laughs> okay, we're doing good on health, so I guess I'll just skip that little meta kit. Let's check out what's over here. Oh, that was the door that was locked that we couldn't get into. Okay, okay. Looks like a point of no return. <laughs> all right. I hope I found all the little goodies in that area. Because we are jumping in. Oh, this is dumb. We should be pushing in. We hold the perimeter until we hear otherwise. Keep an eye out. Oh, no. They have a dog. I got something. Shit. Infected. Let's get in there. Oh, my God. All right, time to set one of these. You think this guy's connected to the girl from the school? Be a hell of a if there weren't. I hate 
these small groups. Big groups, it's a straight fight. These loners. Oh my god! Ambush! Motherfucker! Right here! Alright, looks like there's some more. I saw some movement out of the court. Yep, there we go. Oh man, it's another dog. Okay, gotta set one of these. Poor doggy. I blew him up. So sorry. Oh man. <laughs> I feel terrible. I don't know. It's kind of weird, you know, the way they sort of force you into killing the dogs, but, you know, it is realistic. Oh, there's more? Wow. All right, well, let's set this over here. And flank them. Definitely more than I thought would be in this area. There we go. Oh no, not another dog. She ran into that building. Where'd she go? She can't have gone far. Damn. Oh, snap. Nice. That stability really helped. Going. Move in. Roger that. Fuck. Okay, time for a little healing. <laughs> This was a pretty hefty encounter. Okay, I think there's one more way down the line there. Oh, nice.
There we go. Got him. Okay. Okay. <laughs> nice. That is a nice little mechanic there, just to let you know that uh, you're good to go. You don't have to keep sneaking around. Well, that was pretty awesome. Didn't end up using that, but that's a good thing. Ooh, it's a big ball door. I don't know. Might just be there for decoration. All right, so what I'll do is I'll uh, kind of go in my little clockwise direction here. So that says exit. That's probably the exit. So before we head through there, because you know sometimes these things cut you off. Uh, let's finish exploring this area. Does not look like an area we can get to. I bet it's a back door. We are back in business. Ooh. There is no back door. Okay, I guess you can't get in that area. Okay, so once again, fingers crossed that I uh, checked everything out. Actually, I don't know. Okay, now what? Yeah, I know. Maybe I can get in that way. Man, I swear this game just looks like you can just totally explore way more than you actually can. <laughs> okay, I've been in there and there and there. Okay, let's go for it.
Yep, no going back. <laughs> Gravity works. Anybody hear that? Okay, cool. I bet we got to move this around to the side to climb over it. We are clear. Another workbench. Sounds like Boris tried to resist the wolves to to no avail. I think I'm going to save the points because doesn't it look like there's one more slot available to the right of that revolver? And if that's the case, I want to have some uh, parts ready to go for it, especially if it's like a flamethrower or something, you know. Ooh, it's a basement. Oh, I'm full. All right, should we go for it now or come back to it? I think I'm going to come back to it just because um, 
you know, <laughs> I want to make sure I check out these other areas before I skip anything. Did we come through here? Yeah, that was the bike shop. Ooh, a tattoo parlor. Huh. An actual tattoo shop. All right, so they keep mentioning a stadium. That's probably something we'll encounter later. Okay, so that looks like a thing. Let me uh, just check around here. Yep, yeah, okay. Let's see what's going on here. Whoa. Do you guys hear that? Okay, won't let me, uh... Let me just see something real quick. Ooh, there's infected in there. Um... Yeah, let's go for it. Sweet. Oh, they're still coming. Is that it? Fuck was that? Oh, I wasn't too bad. Wow. I got quite a few with that, uh, Molotov. Maybe that was just, you know, pretty strategic there. Looks like they've been locked in here for years. Wow, we're finding some good little pills there. Still looking for that next manual, though. Ooh, it's a safe. Usually the clue is pretty close. Emergency phone number. Oh, it's blank. Did I miss a note in here? Alright. So, I mean, maybe it's not right in this little area. Maybe it's just up ahead. Um, so people in the comments have been saying that uh, you can open these safes, you know, just by listening for the clicks. But I like to kind of find the clues, so we'll put a pin in that and come back to it.
All right, that's locked. Whoa. Oh, it's a bloater. Fuck. Schindler. Oh, there's two of them. Let's do a little, uh, Rick and Molotov combo here. Loving that revolver with the extra damage. So it looks like if you catch them off guard, you can one hit them. And uh, if they're aware of you, it takes two hits, which is better than three hits. You know what I mean? I think there'd be an extra bottle around here, wouldn't there? It's a bar, after all. Oh, there we go. There's the safe combo. 30, 82, 65. 30, 82, 65. I'm going to run and grab that before I forget those numbers. That was back here, right? How do I get to those stairs? Okay, so that was an example of where it wasn't right next to the safe, but it wasn't too far away. Sweet. Yes, yes, that's what I was looking for. Awesome. Awesome. It's the short holster. Nice. Okay, that, that's going to make a big difference. Some nice parts and ammo. Oh, I got stocked up. See, this is great because I can go back and forth between the, um, the silenced weapon and, uh, you know... The one that does a little bit more damage. So that's killer. And I didn't forget about that basement. So let's check that out before we move on to the next area. Oh, and I have... Uh, Room for a snack, too. Oh, come on. Ooh, that's two shamblers.
Okay, so if they come through either of those doors, they're going to feel the wrath. And craft a Molotov real quick. Oh, I've only got one. That got them both. Awesome. Awesome. All right. That's the way I kind of like to play it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Done. Oh, okay. That smell. I hate shamblers. All right. We're running low on Molotovs. Let me uh, pick some of this stuff up here. Yeah, we have no Molotovs left. Uh oh, Raggy. Wow, this is like a whole little underground area. Oh man, I'm so happy I didn't miss that uh, short holster. I'm psyched about that. I could have totally forgotten about that safe, you know? <laughs> and just moved on to the next area. Ooh, this is a, a prone situation here. Okay, so that's just pretty much where I just was. Cool. Little hobby shop or something. Oh, wow. I think it's another manual. Rifle scopes. Uh oh. This might have some potential. Precision. <laughs> nice. Oh, look at that. Oh, definitely, definitely. Listen mode range. Oh, that is killer. Hold breath. Well, we just got this right here. That's a hundred percent. Oh, look at that. Uh, this skill is locked until you acquire a prerequisite weapon. So that confirms my theory that there is another weapon to be found. So I'm just going to save the rest until we get that. But I'm very happy about that. Yeah, this was this has been pretty awesome so far. Had some very... Ooh, look at that. Oh, that's cool. That was... Yeah, I saw that, uh... 
open window from up there, but I knew I couldn't get to it. So it's kind of cool that you come out the other side. So yeah, we uh, we got pretty equipped in this episode so far. Found the short holster, found a new skill manual, and uh, had some pretty strategic combats there. So I'm happy. <laughs> Gotta remember to break those windows, man. They almost, they look so skippable, you know? figured as much all right so uh this back door is probably the way to the next area oh nice Just in case. Nice shot. <laughs> well, I think we got a little foreshadowing of what our next weapon is. Which is awesome because uh, bows are silent in Last of Us. So I'm glad I saved those points and those uh, parts. Well, who was that? You did that, Tommy. Oh, there's movement. I could probably get this last one. I just uh, ran out of the silencer there. Assuming he's the last one. Yep. Nice and efficient. Love it. Okay. Once again, <laughs> looks bigger than it actually is. See if I can make another silencer. I can. Awesome. Back up to five of those bad boys.
Oh, it's a little stuffed animal. I was like, what the heck's that? Dirty old hot tub. I was going to say, is that another manual? It's just an ad. What was that I can make? Oh, a Molotov, definitely. That guy was a little freedom fighter for his neighborhood, wasn't he? Okay, so I think uh, through here is the way to go. Whoa! Get off me! Oh my god! I forgot how to dodge, dang! <laughs> Ooh, he pushed me away. There we go. Ooh, he's a really smart one. Ooh. Oh, there's the bow. Look at that. <laughs> that was worth the struggle. Oh, that is so awesome. And I can craft them. Well, let me do some healing real quick. Yeah, I think those are another kind of uh, infected type called stalkers or something. And uh, they're a little smarter and faster than uh, than the regular um, runners or clickers. So that's why he was dodging right alongside me there. <laughs> I was hoping there'd be a workbench right there, but I guess not. That's one way to use mannequins. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, let's let's check this out. Okay, I'm gonna fire one. I hope I can retrieve it. Dang, that was a pretty precise shot there. All right, awesome. Before I leave this area, let me just double check and make sure I got everything. Okay, we're good. Awesome, and you can... You can retrieve your arrows. That is awesome. Oh, okay. From a headshot. Okay, so maybe it just... Maybe it has to be a headshot. That is excellent. Let me see how many I can craft here. Oh, you can only carry six. Alright, 
we are doing pretty good. I gotta say. Nope, I didn't want to do that. Okay, I have a feeling this is gonna head into a whole new area where I'm gonna have to use my bow, so I'm probably gonna end the episode here. But, um, that was awesome, man. We got super duper equipped. Shortgun holster, new manual, and a bow. Which is totally silent, if it's like the first game, which I'm assuming it is. Let's see if I can... Oh, you can break these windows. Is there anything in there? Maybe around the other side? Nah, okay. All right, well, uh, yeah, we'll tackle this next area in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate the positivity in the comments and stuff. I know this game isn't for everybody, but for the people that are watching it, they seem to be loving it. And I'm loving it so far. It's so good, you know what I mean? So make sure you smash that like button and share the video around, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching, and stay smart.